And now, your Big 2 Local Weather Authority forecast. We warn you first. Good morning, everyone. We have a stormy start in Big Spring. This is the camera cam provided by Roofs by Nicholas. And you see the rain all the way up in there. That's the downdraft that just came. We just had a lightning strike that you just saw out in the distance by the hills in Big Spring. And that's the story. The I-20 corridor between Big Spring and Stanton seeing showers and thunderstorms right now that also may impact the Midland and Odessa area. And with that, we also have the heat. 96 degrees for our forecast high today and our forecast low 69 degrees so it's a couple degrees above our averages but closer to average nonetheless so good news right so enough those triple digit readings but current temperatures right now in the low to mid 70s along with some of those showers that we're seeing in big spring at 70 degrees and as we look in the next several hours those temperatures getting close to 100 degrees in Pecos mid to upper 90s for our neck of the woods in Midland Odessa temperatures dropping into the upper 60s and low 70s as we head to tomorrow morning and Again, temperatures in the mid to upper 90s, closer to average for this time of year, maybe a little bit cooler as we head for tomorrow. As we take a look at those headlines, you do have, again, the chance for thunderstorms today, especially as we head through the afternoon rush in the eastern uh, basin and parts of the Trans-Pagus as well. But average temperatures, especially as we head for the next several days. And once we get through today, breezy, sunny, and dry. So if we get through today, then we have drier conditions in sight. And because we have those thunderstorms, we have quite a bit of moisture in our neck of the woods. 66 degree dew point in Big Spring. That's because we have that thunderstorm, and that's providing a lot of moisture. And you see, over the past several hours, we did have some showers come throughout the Trans-Pecos, and now we have some showers and thunderstorms in the northeastern basin, as well as some showers near Carlsbad. So that's the big story right now. And you do see the past couple hours, those storms really making its way down near the Big Spring I-20 corridor area. So. We did, we, made, we did see some lightning strikes. There could even be some small hail. I'm not expecting there to be severe weather today, but just something to keep an eye on just in case. Again, this model's not really picking that up, but we do see the chances of showers and storms as we head throughout the southeastern trans Vegas and as we see that near the Mexican border as well. As we head into tonight, temperatures, and I mean, the sky starts to clear out, and tomorrow, even clearer as we head throughout the next few hours. As we take a look at that seven day forecast, you do notice that those temperatures are in the mid 90s, drying out breezy. Thursday is going to be my pick of the week, I think. Ample sunshine. Saturday and Sunday, though, those temperatures start to go up, Mark. So more on that coming up.